We're on the PGA show floor and we have checked out dozens, if not hundreds of brands here. It's been an awesome few days. But the one thing that we need to check out, which has really grown exponentially, is the women's golf presence here. So who better to do that with us than our unofficial third host of the podcast, yes. Elizabeth Diane Beath, joining us. Elizabeth, how's it going at the PGA show? It's going great. It's been awesome. I know. The, the hecticness is real. It's pretty crazy out here. Oh, but yeah. what we're going to do is we're going to check out some of the newest, latest, and greatest women's golf brands. How are you feeling? Really excited. All right, excited to take a look at some oh, stories yeah. and learn more about the brands? Definitely. Let's do it. All right, the first women's golf brand we're checking out has the Austin, Texas connection. I'm local to Austin, and so is Danielle with IA Golf, who's here on the PGA Show for the first time. How does it feel to be finally here and debuting the brand? I can't believe I'm here. I'm so excited. It's been two years in the making with this brand, so this is my big hurrah. Tell everyone a little bit about backstory on the brand and how it came to be as well. Yeah, so I've been golfing for over 20 years. I played competitively when I was younger and just socially as an adult. And I was tired of seeing the same old, same old in the pro shops, the same pink, the same flamingos, the same fluff. And I said, I want to create something that I would actually wear on the golf course. So two years ago, I quit my job and I've been doing this full time ever since creating Aya Golf, which is more of a athleisure style for the golf course. Love seeing someone go after their dreams like that. Now, Elizabeth, yes. as yeah. a female golfer who's big on this athleisure wear, what are your first thoughts when you take a look at their wardrobe? Yeah, here? absolutely love it. Um, my favorite thing are these shorts because they're double-sided. As a female golfer, a lot of shorts are very see-through underneath your skirt, and it's really hard to find something that's going to actually be not see-through right. um, and will hold up. The durability is awesome. Um, also, absolutely love this. Um, I know you've got it on. Yes. Um, it's absolutely amazing, the, the quilted pattern. So I saw this texture one day when I was shopping and I said I have to recreate this for a golfing woman. And here we are. Awesome. Elizabeth, what's your favorite pick here? What do you like most? Yeah, the like I said, wardrobe? the shorts. I think the shorts are yeah. my go-to. Specifically because a lot of golf um, dresses don't come with shorts. So that's the really difficult piece is right. that um, you know, you can have an amazing golf dress like this one right here, and if it doesn't have shorts underneath, you have to buy them. And so th those are my go-to. Love seeing the IA brand branch out. Congrats on the launch, and looking forward to everything in the future. Thank you, I appreciate it. This brand I particularly appreciate, okay? I'm a guy, this is a women's golf brand, but they know the 19th hole culture. They love the 19th hole. They're proud to support it, and they sent me one of their awesome hats. Joined here by Jamie with the Purdy Golf Team. Jamie, how are you doing today? I'm doing so well, so nice to meet you. It's awesome to have you on the show floor, and thanks to the 19th hole. Guys. I love I, you, it. You appreciate the 19th hole as it much, It is the right? best part of golf, in my opinion. <laughs> Elizabeth, what are your thoughts on just the brightness and the fun yeah. energy with Purdy Golf here? I absolutely love the brightness. I also love the material. So talk us through the difference of what your material is and how it is completely different from a golf apparel standpoint. It is absolutely completely different from every other golf apparel I've seen. The reason we started this brand is because I wanted to look the part because I do not play golf very well. Mm. It was a barrier for me to get into a club and feel comfortable. So when we started looking at the way to design our clothes, the first thing that came about was the fabric. We wanted something that flattered women's bodies. Most of these lines right now seem to be designed by men. It seems to be like the men. That inherently doesn't make a lot of sense. It doesn't yeah. make a lot of sense. <laughs> it is a men, it's like the men's cut and then made into a woman's design. You know, it, 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 it didn't make a lot of sense. The fabric was also thin and shiny. It showed everything. So when we looked at things, we really looked at fabric that is gonna, it's all performance based but it's also very stretchy and flattering and it kind of holds you in and it smooths you out. So we really designed with like the woman in mind. I made the clothes that I want to wear, not only on the golf course, but off the golf course. So well. book good, feel good, play yeah, good, right? It's, it's all important. Yeah, it's everything. It's like, it's it's your entire confidence. It's, it's you know, it, if you look the part, you know, it, it makes everything a little bit more. And golf is historically just unapproachable for women especially. We wanted to take at least that barrier out of women trying to play the game. Talk us through how you can take a piece like this from a golf course to yeah, happy hour. Well, I'll tell you what I did yesterday. I was in this dress all day long here. It's a long day. Yeah. This is an amazing show. Yeah, it is a lot of energy Very long. Yep. and it is a long day. And this, you know, it stayed really nice together. It doesn't stretch out when you wear it all day. I was sitting, I was standing, I was moving. 
this wasn't in the plan, but we got invited for cocktails right after Always, the show. Yeah. Always. Wound up being out all night long in this. Got so many compliments. You know, just threw on a pair of sneakers, word out, put one of our vests over it. Everything that we make is very much made to be layered together. So you can be pretty matchy matchy if that's your vibe, or you can kind of just the, the colors all are meant to play off each other. Love the zippers in regards to your design there. Talk us through like, you know, how did you come up with this design and making the zipper the staple? So we wanted to respect the sport of golf, but we also wanted to kind of expand the offerings. So we know that there are clubs out there that have very strict you know, dress codes. Right. And then there are the municipal clubs you can wear, you know, your joggers at or whatever. So we wanted to make things that you could, you know, you can take down if you want a little bit of sexiness or sassiness, or you can go all the way up and then it's a long collar and you're good to go. You know, Perfect. it's pretty appropriate for any sort of golf course, any sort of encounter. You don't have to be worried about getting kicked out of the club because yes, you're not appropriately true. dressed. Then you go to happy hour and you know this comes down a little bit and you're right? like out to play so it's you know we just wanted to make it multifunctional now you have the 19th hole on a lot of your hats here yeah. i have a 19th hole hat of my own now so the million dollar question is what is the 19th hole order for jamie for pretty golf oh my god so i always order a burger yep, i okay. don't know why i mean even after the show yesterday I went to a seafood restaurant, I'm like, I need a burger. Golf brings out like the meat burger. It's because you earned it, you walk, you I feel like the it's energy a lot burned. of energy expended too. Yes, exactly. Love that. And then I love the John Daly, the iced tea and vodka. It's my favorite drink. We actually, can I move over here for one second? Yep. Yeah. Oh, we actually created our like standard golf polo and we called it the June Daily. Oh, Love it. After the perfect. Job. Yeah. Awesome. So that is definitely my, my go-to drink on the course and off the course. We're going to John Daly. That's Love it. it. Awesome. All right, we're continuing our tour of unique women's golf brands on the PGA Show floor. This one is unique, also an award winner uh, this show season as well, too. We're joined by Jen with the 4-All team. Jen, how are you doing today? Good, really good. It's been exciting. This is like Everyone's been so nice. It's been so fun. Yeah, yeah. this is great. And the reception for the brand too. You said yeah. you're a little surprised by it, but tell me a little bit what happened this week for you. Oh, you guys, we literally just won two awards. Best dressed, best new fashion um, women uh, brand is actually what it's called. Everyone's loving the colors, loving the pattern and the fabrics, which mm. has been great feedback for us as a team at For All, like knowing, because these buyers know what they're talking about. You know, they've been touching and feeling. And so now to hear the feedback, it's been really lovely. Absolutely love this dress. Yeah. Fabrics, as you mentioned. So talk us through what you might have done or what you guys did differently in regards to fabrics. Because it's so breathable, but lightweight. Yeah, we were really big. Like, first off, we're just trying to perfect our swings out here. We're not yeah. great swingers. Right? <laughs> we don't swing really well. We want something light Fair and enough. easy. Yeah. Plus, we wanted to do something that like didn't show our sweat as women. Yes. I hate the whole like, oh, I'm going to be worrying about like any watermarks on my yes. dresses. So we sat there and tested out fabrics. And this was like the softest, lightweight fabric that we could find that like if we were dropping like tons of like, actually Starbucks strings is what we were doing. Yes, right? We were drinking the Starbucks strings. And on the fabric, and just make sure they kind of rolled off. Yeah. They didn't absorb. It's just super cool. Yeah. yeah. I love it. Plus, we got the retro vibe. Yes. Still have the little tea um, details. We're all about the details. Intricate like that. Yeah. So, and I love, like, we love the different texture play on play. So, like, the ribbed collar with this nice poly. It's just, it's super nice. Yeah. yeah. Love the details, especially the pockets. Like, yes. you've got to have those for golf balls. You've got to have them for, yeah. you know, more tees, yeah. um, your cell phone, yeah. all of the things. So, I absolutely love phone, us. You know? Yes. Yes. Yeah. And then talk to us about your accessories. Women are about accessories in general, right? Shoes, handbags, it's all those little things, touches, like little details. So like, for example, like I'm wearing this swing bag, like this bag, and it has this little T ball marker magnet. You can put T's here, little, you know, utility here. It's magnetic, but plus everyone's like, oh, well, how do you swing in it? I'll tell you how, you just swing it to the back. So we yeah. made it where it's movable and then you're able to just swing. That's key, I yeah, like that. Awesome. Yeah. So, awesome. and then plus, of course, like our like pretty ball sack. <laughs> I love that, by the way. Yep. This sells out all the time. Who doesn't love one of those? No, <laughs> everybody wants a pretty ball sack. Yep. Yes. Yeah. So, and it, people are like, I want like 50 of them. I want these for gifts. <laughs> so it's been really great. The quality is super nice. Like 
everyone's just been awesome. So I love, love a little bit more accessories. And then of course, the club pad covers. We're launching our new for all flamingo. We got our mallet putter covers. We love just to mix and match. Very so, nice. Yeah. Awesome. For all, for literally for all golfers. Yeah. Appreciate yeah, it. Yeah. Jen, thank you for joining yeah, us here at the PGA you. Show. Thank you. This one caught my attention, not only because they love birdies, they love the brighter, greener things in golf, and they also are fans of the 19th hole. Joined by Rochelle here with Birdie Golf Social. Rochelle, how are you doing today? I'm good, thanks for having us, we're yeah. honored. So tell me a little bit about the background on Birdie Golf Social as well. Yeah, so we're about to turn three in March, nice. strong but biting, um, but we, my, my business partner, Hayden and I came from the fashion industry previously, okay. grew up playing golf, so really mixing business with pleasure. So the whole concept is course to cocktail. So how do you get women to transition throughout their day, wear your golf shoe, but also throw on a kitten heel afterwards, and then you feel super elevated, put together, can run your errands, go to lunch, um, grab a cocktail at the club, um, and still feel kind of your best self and feel like you're you're out of your traditional golf clothes and have fun prints and colors and you feel really confident. Nice, and one thing that immediately stuck out to me just as a golfer is you're leaning into the best and most beautiful greens that there are. <laughs> uh, tell me about your love for the color green and how you showcase it in the product. Well, no, it's, it's always been our best-selling color and we started with that that birdie green and, and we're so close to Augusta too and then the Masters and oh, really okay. into that too. So that green gingham has always been like our bread and butter. So uh, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Talk me through how you designed it, what your idea was. I know there's a fun backstory on this one. Oh yes, so Hayden, my business partner, she um, grew up going to Hilton Head Island. One of our girlfriends based in Charlotte did the watercolor custom for us. So we kept it very local, very in-house. So it's really nice because We've got, we're in North Carolina, so we've got the coast and we've got uh, the mountains, so it's really nice to kind of really lean into all the beautiful things that are in that state. Um, but yes, yeah, so it's our coastal collection, which we absolutely love, and it feels really close to home. It's so fun working with friends on this project, too. Yeah. It's like a vacation in a golf skirt. Yeah, right? Exactly. Ab absolutely yeah. love it. We're not scared of friends. Right, yeah, and so talk me through some more prints over here, too. This vest, I absolutely love this print. I think that's cool, it's like two vests in one. Exactly, so this is our range vest, so it's really Really nice too because it's got a subtle pop of blue, um, reversible, which is great too. So you've got again, if you want to do your plaid on plaid, you're a girl after my own heart, but then you can also reverse it, and then you've got a really great, like soft chocolate brown as well. Um, and this is just such a fun layering piece. Like, I my husband's English and we go hunting, and like I wore this also shooting, so it's so nice. nice. So it's love it's that course to. <laughs> beyond. Course to, you know, Wait, hunting. Other, yeah, to hunting. Not only for birdies, but also exactly. for... Hunting for birdies. Yes. <laughs> well, well, indeed. I appreciate the color and the functionality with Birdie Golf Social. So I am curious, your 19th hole connoisseurs. First, I'm going to ask, what, what is the on-course cocktail? You mentioned course to cocktail. Yeah. What's your favorite on-course cocktail? This is my favorite question. Um, so on-course, a transfusion, Yep. obviously. Okay. That works well. <laughs> and off-course? Yep. What's I the 19th hole there? The, the meal and the drink after the round? Okay. Okay. Club sandwich, obviously, curly fries, if that's an option, and then, of course, an Aperol spreads. Nice. That might be the first curly fry suggestion in the history yeah, of that question. I, I'm, that honestly should be my side hustle is like a, a curly fry connoisseur. <laughs> awesome. Birdie Golf <laughs> Team Curly Fries. Team Curly Fries. <laughs> This is a very unique concept because they take golf in a lot of other sports. It's a whole lifestyle brand here at the Glovett booth and we're with Karen with the Glovett team. How yeah, are you today? Hi, doing great. Thank you. Awesome. It's really cool to feature the brand and it looks like this is a golf brand that definitely goes beyond the game and, and it kind of takes into an entire lifestyle. You know, we love to elevate the whole fashion and style with golf and give the women something really that they're proud of and love and enjoy the game even that much more. And I love the play on words with Glove It. It's a great <laughs> yeah. brand name that resonates with a lot of people in the community. You gotta Glove It. And as Elizabeth as our third host is definitely a connoisseur in the yeah. women's golf apparel game and is very curious specifically about these tennis bag totes that I'm seeing as well too. Yes. Yeah, so talk us through the design here. Well these are all made out of PU and it's more of the textured, a little more sophisticated look to them. With all the multi pockets, I mean I use it for work, I use it for my gym bag, I use it all the time for anything. It's a great weekender with a little tote bit, a little bristlet and everything to go along. Yeah, I love the matching, I love the pattern. Um, as well as, as this actual golf bag, from a pattern standpoint, these head covers are awesome. So talk us through 
design wise, I know that, you know, normally historically you have very loud, bright items and this seems a little, it, it's still very loud, but it's a little bit more yeah. subtle. So yeah. Talk yeah. 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 So we have our Glovet prints that we're known for, a little sportier look, mm. but then with this, we call this, this is from our signature collection. Okay. So it's a little more sophisticated, um, you know, higher quality fabrics, a little different there, but just more of the tonal or very rich detail yeah. to it. Yeah, and you've got some great details here in regards to tees and pockets. Pockets seem to be the theme, yeah. which is awesome. As, as we all know, you definitely need a bunch of pockets to put, whether it's tees, golf balls, anything yes. you can think of in a pocket, which yeah. is great. All very functional, but yet really fashionable. I know that you also do gloves, the very flashy gloves, and that's really, I would say, what you might be most known for. So talk us through, you know, breaking into more of the refinements, as I mentioned earlier. Um, yeah, and, and getting into that still, signature. Yeah. It's all bringing out your own personal style in the game. So then you have more fun and you get yeah. to, you know, really show off what, how you're feeling and change the look with each day. So whether it's golf, you know, with all the fun prints and our nine and wine, or it could be a fun pickleball bag or tennis or golf. Um, we just love to give those options and make it different, not just your yeah. basic standard like right. white glove or something like that. Yeah, and there's a lot out there that's just basic and very, very yeah. standard. So it's yeah. awesome to see loud prints and have that option of, as you mentioned, depending on what mood you're in, if it's a loud print day or if it's yeah. a, hey, I want to refine it based on my loud outfit, yeah. you can you can mix and match. You have a lot of fun with it. Yeah. That's what it's all about. Very well put, Karen. So uh, we love talking about the 19th hole culture in our content. <laughs> yes. so you just mentioned nine and wine. What kind of wine would that be if you're a nine and wine there? Oh, a nice it? red. Uh. <laughs> mm, okay, there we go. There nice. we go, yeah. Nice refined red. This is the yes. Golden Booth here at the PGA yeah. Show. Check them out. That is a wrap on our tour of the women's golf brands here at PGA Show with Elizabeth Diane Beef. Um, first off, just quick highlights. I know we first got to check out Aya Golf, a local Austin friend of mine. Uh, talk to me about your thoughts just on her inspirational story, how she created the brand. Yeah, it's awesome. Um, she really, you know, said, I'm gonna be all in, but her job decided to build something that she knew was needed, especially from a clubhouse standpoint of what she was seeing in the pro shop and what she wasn't seeing in the pro shop. So yeah. it's awesome. I appreciate the woman in entrepreneurship for sure. And then we got to visit our friends at Purdy Golf, who are all about the 19th hole culture, which we love. I'm still rocking their hat. What was your favorite part of interacting with the Purdy team? Yeah, absolutely love their bright colors. Um, love their fabric. Their fabric is, you know, moisture wicking, but it does hold you in. And I, I absolutely love their story. That was a casual kind of wear and a fun little fun loving brand. But then to get a little bit more serious have a little bit more refinement. We checked out Birdie Golf Social and For All, which kind of give a little bit more of a lifestyle vibe to yeah. golfers. Yeah, yeah, and absolutely love both of those brands. Um, they have amazing patterns, amazing prints. Green is the color this year, clearly. There's a lot of that out there. Really, I, I would say with both of them, they had such unique designs from a print standpoint and just a design standpoint of where they have things and accessorizing yep. it. And it, that's awesome because Recently, we haven't had a lot in the golf world other than that. It's very much of your, here's your standard polo, and we go from there. Right. So it's awesome to see. That was cool. And then we wrapped with Glove It. We got to see the functionality of not only golf accessories, but accessories just for the entire day of a woman out there as well, too. Yeah, it, it's great. You can throw a racket in there. You can, you know, put, you can take it out of the course with you. You can use it when you're running errands. It, it was really functional and different, and I love their new signature line. It, it's definitely refined from their crazy, loud brands that they have before. Uh, but you can still mix and match, which is awesome. Awesome. Well, thank you for tuning in there. Be sure to subscribe right down below and enjoy ours and Elizabeth's content in the future. And we'll see you at the next PGA show.